especially for women who are, you know, go-getters, who are professionals, who get it done, who are high-performing, high-achieving, hyper-focused, you know, how, what subtle signs, what are the telltale signs that they might have to let them realize, oh, wow, I might be struggling with anxiety, even if I've sort of coped all this while, this discomfort is probably a symptom of anxiety or the other. So what are some of those things to look out for? Thank you, um, Dr. F Dr. Flavi Brown. So I would say that the vast majority of high-performing women don't stop until mm -hmm. something starts to impede their ability to function. So like many uh, high-performing professional women are juggling 10 things at once. And when they start to feel like they're not operating at capacity or they cannot keep up anymore is typically when they start to present for help finally. Mm -hmm. um, but I would say commonly what we see is disturbed is the sleep a lot. Like, mm -hmm. so now Typically, we know that if people are able to sleep at night, they can recover a little bit and continue their day. But yeah. oftentimes, if you start to find out that when you lay down to sleep at night, now you're ruminating, your mind is going a mile a minute, you cannot wind down and you mm. pop up, you look at your clock, it's 1 a.m., it's 3 a.m., mm. that's definitely a sign that things are not right. Some people um, on the other end wake up, they pop up super early and they find that they're afraid to face their day. People who were fully functional before mm -hmm. suddenly find that they wake up in the morning and they are fearful of facing the day and everything mm -hmm. that they have to do. So that's a sign that something is wrong. Some of the subtle signs would be maybe like recurrent headaches um, mm -hmm. because you're not aware that you've been so tense, like because when people are anxious, they're tense. I was speaking to a dentist even recently on this ish a topic and people grind their teeth a lot mm -hmm. when they're anxious. So like if you start to find out that you're having lots of jaw pain, mm -hmm. back muscle tension all day and, and not realizing why it could be a pointer to um, anxiety and irritability is another one. I meet yeah. moms who are like, suddenly everything my children uh, do, it annoys me. I just cannot take it and I'm annoyed mm -hmm. with my husband all the time. It could be a pointer that there's so much going on in the mind that you're mm -hmm. tense and you have no bandwidth for mm -hmm. people in your life. Small things just annoying you um, a lot. I would say those are yeah. subtle signs that pop out.